Good morning, friends. It's Miss Parkin. Let's get started with our song. I have a positive attitude. I'm responsible, have integrity. I'm dedicated and exceed expectations. I have jackrabbit pride. Yeah! I have jackrabbit pride. Yeah! I have jackrabbit pride. Yeah! I have a positive attitude. I'm responsible, have integrity. I'm dedicated and exceed expectations. I have jackrabbit pride. Yeah! Let's continue with our story. Yesterday, swimmer, jumper, and skipper had a great time playing charades and when it started to get boring, they uh, decided to put on a performance with some of Swimmer's brothers and sisters. The next day, Swimmer, Jumper, and Skipper were sitting around and they were like, what should we do? And Jumper was like, can we, can we, can we do something like outside? Outside would be awesome. I love outside. Outside is beautiful. I love the sun. And Skipper was like, hey, well, we could do another show. That would be awesome. Like, we could do another show. And Jumper was like, no. Like, that was fun for, like, a day or two. But, like, can we, I want to do something else besides putting on a show. Well, like, it would be really cool to put on another show. Let's be honest, Skipper, Swimmer said. You just want to be in charge and tell people what to do again. Maybe. But I also like telling stories, too. Sure. Sure, Skipper. Sure. And so Jumper was getting a little antsy, so he went outside to go do some 200, 300 jumps. The water had gone down by about a, a foot now, so there was a little bit more space outside to do his jumping. But then after he was done, he went back inside, and Swimmer and Skipper were arguing of what they should do next. And Jumper, at this point, was like, stop it. Stop arguing over stuff. Like, we're just stuck inside, and, like, this is miserable, and I can't stand it. And, like, no offense, Swimmer, but, like, your brothers and sisters are, like, really messy. It's, like, a mess everywhere. Like, I have to, like, do, like, an obstacle course every time I come inside because, like, your brothers and sisters leave raw toys everywhere. It's driving me nuts. And Swimmer was like, hey, well, like, if it bothers you, like, you can just pick it up. Like, don't your brothers and sisters pick up after themselves? Um, I don't know. That's a good question. Hey, Mom, Swimmer said. And Swimmer's mom was like, yes, dear? Do you, like, my brothers and sisters, do they, like, pick up after themselves? Like, are they, like, responsible? And Swimmer's mom was like, they're only responsible when I tell them to. Oh, I'm sorry, Jumper. All the, this is a, quite a mess in here. Boys, girls, come pick up after yourselves. And so some of the little jackrabbits came and started picking up the stuff they left out. But they did it kind of like half-heartedly. Like they'd just be like, and they'd move it about a foot, and that would be kind of good enough. And Jumper was like, dude, like your siblings have no idea how to pick up and like do it with like energy and like passion and like, yeah. And Swimmer was like, really? Like, do you pick up at your house with so much gusto and joie de vie? Joie de vie is uh, French for joy of life. And Jumper was like, yeah, I do. And Swimmer was like, well, what's your secret? Cause honestly, sometimes I don't want to pick up after myself. And Jumper was like, here's a secret. You make it a competition. Like, my cleanup time right now is about 30 seconds. When I first started off, it was about 10 minutes of, of like, cleanup. But then 
after working really hard, I got my time down to about 30 seconds to clean up everything I got to clean up. And Swimmer was like, wow, that's like really impressive. And Skipper was like, I think I know what we're going to do today. And Swimmer was like, you do? And Skipper was like, yeah. Jumper, you kind of know what I'm thinking? And Jumper was like, yeah. And Swimmer was like, please, someone tell me what we're doing today. And so Jumper explains that we are going to have an Olympics competition with your brothers and sisters. And Swimmer was like, okay, like, so what, is, this sounds kind of cool. What, what are some of the events we're gonna do? Well, there's the obstacle course where you have to get around all the toys that are on the floor. Okay, that that's, that sounds a little dangerous. What if someone trips? Well, then we go on to our next competition. Relay put away, where they have to put away their toys and their stuff as fast as possible. And we'll split them up in teams. And whatever team does the fastest wins. And, like, then we'll have a jumping competition where they have to jump to try to dust everything in your house. Because, dude, your house is, like, a little dusty. And, like, my allergies are kind of, like, going cray-cray right now. And Swimmer was like, okay, but, like, what happens to the, like, the winning team? Like, what do they get? Hmm. It's like, that's a good question. And Jumper was like, hey, Swimmer's mom. And Swimmer's mom came in and said, yes, Jumper. And Jumper told her the idea that they had about Olympics to get bunny rabbits clean up. And... Swimmer's mom was like, that's a great idea. And so, Jumper, Swimmer, and Skipper spent a good, probably about a few minutes to figure out the different events. And then they had a full one to two days of epic Olympics cleaning competition. And Swimmer's brothers and sisters really enjoyed it. And the winning team was supposed to get carrot cake cookies, but everyone did such a great job that Swimmer's mom made carrot cake cookies for everyone. So it was a great and delicious day. All right, let's end our time with our Jackrabbit chant. We are Jackrabbits. We show our pride at the end of the day. We know we've tried. Believe we can achieve. We'll reach any dream. We are Jackrabbits. We are a team. Woo! One school. One team, one school, one team. Bye, see you tomorrow.